Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new unboxing. Today I've got a really cool one for you. It's a box lunch exclusive 30 year anniversary Little Mermaid Pop. There we go. It's Ariel. So, so excited for this one. I cannot believe that she just kind of like appeared out of nowhere the other day um, on Instagram and I was like, I have to have this pop. So um, luckily my dad, while I was at work, my father went and uh, picked her up for me. He knows how much I love Funkos. So he was like, uh, I don't know if you need this one, but here it is. And I was like, this is exactly the one that I need. So it was super, super cool that he picked her up. I really appreciate it. Thanks, Dad. You're awesome. Um, take a look at this. As you can see, it's celebrating 30 years of Little Mermaid. The box lunch exclusive sticker right here. We're going to turn her to her side. That's what she looks like. Super duper cool. And here she is to the gonna dive right back into the Little Mermaid and do another Little Mermaid unboxing. I'm excited. Are you guys excited? Let's do this. Okay, guys. Here she is out of her box. We have, I'm going to call her Shipwreck Ariel. Like, this is her in her shipwreck dress. So, so cute. Um, I absolutely love this pop. She's completely adorable. Um, I actually have like an original video of this already filmed, but I got inspired. I saw this and I was like, hey, I'm totally gonna film this here. So this is what she looks like. Super, super cute. She is a Black Hunt exclusive, of course. And they just announced a Target exclusive for her and Ariel, uh, for her and Eric's movie moment for Kiss the Girl. Um, kind of saw that coming. Oh, didn't think it was gonna be Target though, but I'm really excited. So I will get my hands on that one. Um, absolutely love her. She's so amazing. One of my, well, she is my favorite Disney character. Love her so much. But yeah, this is what she looks like. Super duper cool. I just had to get this moment in there really quickly. I just, very cool. Amazing. So this is to celebrate, again, 30 years of The Little Mermaid. Why I'm so happy about this pop though is like, not only is it The Little Mermaid celebrating 30 years, but I'm also celebrating 30 years of life. So Ariel and I, we're like, we're like this. We're, we're pretty, yeah, we're, we're pretty in sync. Um, huge fan of Little Mermaid growing up. I love Little Mermaid. Um, I have pretty much every Ariel pop. And I've been saying this for like three years now that I really wanted to have like um, a collection of Ariel pops and her different looks. And I did not think they would ever come out with her shipwreck look. As much as I wanted it, I didn't think it was possible. And lo and behold, Box Lunch brings one out. So I'm so, so happy that I have her as a part of my collection. And actually, I got to see Ariel today uh, for a little while after work, um, which is really cool. Went on down to Disney and I saw her there. So I was like, awesome, really, really awesome. So it kind of turned into like a Little Mermaid sort of day uh, for me, which I loved. Um, but I like I spent a few hours in Disney and then I was like, I'm gonna go home and just kinda kick it, unbox this pop, and yeah, here she is. She looks amazing. So let's turn her to her side. So so cool. I just love that her hair is like flowing in her face as well. Like, absolutely love that about this pop. Just I I don't know if she's my favorite. I've been like debating that all day, like which Ariel Pop is my favorite. I think once I have all of the different versions of her, I'll go ahead and line them up and then like decide then. Um, yeah, because this would be really hard for me to do right now. Like I'm trying to think of all of them. Um, oh, there's so many versions of her and I think she just looks great in each one. Let's turn her back to the front. Yeah, just very, very cool. And like I said, to me, this was like so unexpected. I know that uh, Box Lunch was like teasing this. I knew Little Mermaid Pops were coming out later this year. I think around like July or August they're supposed to come out, which is going to be like a mermaid version of Ariel, um, her and her, like I said, sparkly dress towards the end, Eric, and then like two versions of Ursula, including a 12 inch version or 10 to 12 inch version, I'm sorry, um, that are coming out that I've already pre ordered those. Um, but yeah, I just, I wasn't expecting to see this one. This one just like, one, it's completely ahead of the others, and two, it just kind of came out of nowhere. Um, I'm kind of hoping that there will be more Little Mermaid exclusives. I mean, it's celebrating 30 years, so I think that's just 
amazing. Um, I'm still waiting for a Vanessa pop from The Little Mermaid. I would love to get my hands on a Vanessa. Um, that's, if you don't know that, that's um, Ursula when she turns into a human. Her name is Vanessa. Yeah, I mean, I would just love to get more of The Little Mermaid and definitely other movies. I think the Disney princes definitely need pops. We don't have very many of them. The princes that have, like, they get, like, no love. So I kind of want more of the princes to get some love. I would love, like, um, Snow White's prince, Prince Charming from Cinderella, uh, Prince Philip, uh, Lee Shang. Definitely so many others to have Funko Pops. Um, even, like, a human version of Beast I think would be really cool, too. Um, but definitely show some more love to the princess and Prince Hans. I know he's not a good guy, but I think he deserves a pop too. So. So, so awesome. And thank you guys so much for all of your likes and follow, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.